Yeah, everything I got, everything I got, I made on my own. Oh, p that hoe, you see that cat? <clears throat> yeah, oh, f I don't give a fuck. The NBA and NBA Young Boy stands for Never Broke Again, which certainly won't happen for this rap superstar. He's been spotted in an assortment of flashy whips, including a Maybach worth 200K, a McLaren worth 250K, and a white Lamborghini, which he smashed up to a tune of 350,000. Okay, how much is this Lamborghini worth? This is at Romaine and uh, Genesee about 1 o'clock this morning. At least 200. Oh, way more than 200. There have been plenty of other cash expenses, like his hundreds of thousands of dollars spent on bail money for his multiple arrests. But even while he was locked away behind bars, his boys were nice enough to go and pick him out a new crib. He was walking up to the house. Uh, mansion. So sad. You know. You already know. He's uh, like a motherfucker. Acre, you hear me? Young Boy Never Broke Again has also opted for some ice, including his Young Thug piece crafted by Shine Jewelers. Now this isn't the only piece he's rocking, with his entire collection estimated to be worth over 500,000. Young Boy Never Broke Again famously became a millionaire at the age of just 18, not bad for a high school dropout who was arrested for burglary and sent to a juvenile detention center during his youth. Now there's a lot of money to go around with him taking care of his loved ones, which include four sons from three different women. Now young boy, he won't be going broke anytime soon, with a net worth of $3 million at the time of this recording, according to CelebrityNetWorth.com. The dude can buy anything he wants, including some exotic house pets. Now I'm gonna hit you guys with a question that I want you to guess in the comments down below. What kind of cat did young boy buy for his crib? Place your guesses down below. The answer will be at the end of this video. What's going on guys, it's your boy Michael McCredden documenting the financial come up of young boy and what he spends his fortune on, here for you on The Rich Life. Now our last video in this series was on Wiz Khalifa, which did actually pretty well, and we conveniently dropped it on 420, who noticed that? Now uh, the most requested video to do following that was this one, but you guys gotta let us know who's next in the comments down below. Alright, I'll see you after that intro. NBA Youngboy's come up story we recently revisited in an updated before their famous video, so let's just roll a clip from that. Youngboy Never Broke Again was born Contrell Deshaun Golden on October 20th, 1999 in Baton Rouge, Louisiana, making him just 19 years old at the time of this recording. Then we live mainly on the north side of town at 38th and Chippewa Street to be exact, a location he used for his music video for What You Gonna Do, and his younger brother NBA Ken, he also played the role of a younger young boy in the video. Make sense? Right. It's yeah, that's it. He's also got an older sister who would beat him up when he was a kid, causing him to hate women for a little while. That certainly changed. Now his mom, she would also give him a whooping at her house out in Scotlandville, and uh, he was also getting into some wrestling brawls. Yeah, like the other kids, they would wrestle too hard, and it resulted in him when he was only four years old breaking his neck. Yeah. Now to recover properly from the injury, he was put into a halo brace, which uh, that was screwed into his head and that's why he still got them visible scars. During young boy's early years, he resorted to petty crime to earn himself enough to keep food in his belly and shoes on his feet, also to afford himself some studio time. Now he started his rap career using a microphone he picked up at a Walmart, and he turned a local buzz into becoming one of the most talked about up and coming rappers of his generation. After releasing five mixtapes in 2015, he exploded onto the scene after collaborating with Kevin Gates and Boozy Badass on 38 Baby. This was in 2016, and that's when the money started pouring in. His record deal with Atlantic Records is rumored to have secured him $2 million for five albums, which earned him his first bag. But his record deal isn't the only source of revenue. When Young Boy was first breaking out onto the music scene, he would post his music videos to a YouTube channel known as David G. Now on there, his breakout hit, 38 Baby, it has since clocked in 90 million views at the time of this recording, earning whoever the hell David G is some serious YouTube ad revenue. Young Boy has since set up his own YouTube channel where the views and subscriber count has skyrocketed to 4.9 million subs and over 3 billion views at the time of this recording. Now even by modest calculations, that's an easy $6 million he's earned off of YouTube alone, and it ain't slowing down. His YouTube channel is pulling in almost 200 million views a month, 
making young boy a very, very rich kid. He's also done a considerable amount of touring throughout 2017 and 2018, only padding his pocket with some more extra cash. He also sells his own merch at neverbrokeagain.com, where a t-shirt will run you $32, a hoodie $75, and shorts $45. He also got a track on the soundtrack for The Fast and the Furious 8 featuring 21 Savage, giving him a little more mainstream success. Now, young boy, he could be making even more money with sponsorships and brand deals, but his legal troubles don't exactly make him the perfect role model. He also had to shell out a considerable amount of money for paying bail and lawyer fees. He was arrested in Texas in December of 2016 because he was a suspect of an attempted first degree murder that was connected to a drive-by shooting. He was released from prison after five months because he agreed to a plea deal and posted bail. He would be arrested again in 2018 on aggravated assault and kidnapping charges, and again, he would post bail this time to a tune of $70,000. All right, now that we've gotten his finances out of the way, let's talk about what he spends his money on. It was while he was in prison that his boys, they went out and bought what is believed to be his very first house or mansion. Man, I wish YB was here for his new house, man. YB, we got that bitch waiting on you, baby. 12 car garage on you, bitch. Now, some sources have reported that this house was for his mama. Either way, with a 12-car garage, this man was in need of a few whips to fill them parking spots. Now, young boy, he's been spotted in a number of expensive cars. I just ran something safe. Damn, ugly. Don't I give a f about you, dog. I got a quarter million dollar car paid for this monster. Youngboy said it himself that this McLaren cost a quarter million dollars. Despite how impressive all that looks, a few Instagram users, they turned up in the comment section to point out that there seems to be a rental tag on his car keys in that video. Meaning that, uh, well, this is a rental. Even if it is, well, it's still a pretty fire whip, and it would cost him a couple grand each and every day. Now, this wouldn't be the only luxury car Youngboy has been said to have rented. The dude has also been spotted in a white 2017 Lamborghini, which he nearly lost his life in. I don't know, I'm gonna just buy a brand new Lambo though. That's what I want, Lambo. According to DJ Academics, well, he was then sued for $350,000 for the cost of the car, but I got a feeling, Youngboy, he skipped out on that bill. The third car we've seen him in possession of is his Maybach, and the only reason we know about this car is because there was video footage uploaded of him reacting to the tires being slashed. Now, the accused culprit is none other than Floyd Money Mayweather's daughter, Yeah, and, uh, well, she has since denied these claims. Hey, you see that? You think I give a f you old p hey, ho? You won't come cut my tire. It ain't just cars for himself though. Over on IG, he is said to have bought a 2018 Mercedes Benz for his baby mama, Janae Jackson. Y'all know what the f going on. <laughs> Hello. Thank you, babe. Thank you. And he's bought his sons their own mini Benzes. Pretty cute. It's okay. Ooh, check you out. Now we talked about his young thug chain in the intro, which is estimated to be worth somewhere between $150,000 to $200,000. But he's been spotted with a few other pendants. On social media, he's shown off his collection, which includes a thick Cuban link gold chain, iced out in diamonds, which forms a perimeter around the rapper's other pieces. These include a massive NBA Never Broke Again chain, featuring quite a bit of gold and a whole lot of diamonds. A Rolex watch similarly adorned in finery, and another gold diamond chain which features a placard which says young NBA boy. Shout out. What up man? YB got a bad ass chain man that's like a $50,000 chain man. We showed him some love on this chain man because he can keep it 100 with us man. Young boy is also taking a page out of Mike Tyson from the Hangover film and he got himself a pet tiger. Tiger! Because well why the hell not? <laughs> now he looked it up online in a pet tiger cub well, it would set him back $2,500, which isn't bad. I mean, there are probably some kinds of exotic cats that would cost just as much. And you know, that's the answer to the question off the top. This time I didn't answer it. Last time I kind of messed that up. All right, guys, I'm wrapping up this episode of The Rich Life. My name is Michael Bucredin. Be sure to let us know who to document next in the comments down below. And the list is endless. I mean, we can do anybody under the sun. Uh, send this video to NBA Youngboy via Instagram or Twitter. Let's see if we can get a reply out of him.
and I'll see you guys in another video. Boom!